Previously on Pokemon Sword. Got a really special one, but look at how many you caught. You're well on your way to building a fine team. Okay, we got a swear. So here, a last little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kit you'll need for camping. Train. Motostoke is surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There are all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. Sir. <laughs> ah, never mind you that. Never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I'd been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. Nope. <laughs> believe in the Pokeball. Let's believe in the Pokeball. Finally. Hello YouTube, welcome to episode 4 of Pokemon Sword. If you remember last time we left off at the far right of the wild area after we had an intense catching session against that Pikachu. So, I did the liberty of coming back here to heal my Pokemon from that person and for this episode we are going to resume exploring the wild area and check Dynamax later on as well along with camping see what we can do so let's go now I'm wondering when this weather will change perhaps every day changes I'm gonna go here once again and check if ever there are new Pokemons. It's another Electric. Maybe we can find a different one. Spancham. Then there's a Tyrogue. We haven't caught ourselves a Tyrogue yet. Because last time we fainted it. We fainted it. Would Water Gun faint this guy? Okay, nope. We'll use. Bite to further decrease its HP, but it's not very effective. Hmm. Actually, let's switch to Pikachu. Then use use Thunder Wave and then one quick attack. Okay, that's good. Didn't do anything to Pikachu first. We're going to use Thunder Wave to inflict paralysis and then one quick attack. Shouldn't faint him, right? Never mind. <laughs> Wonder when we'll be able to catch our Tire Rogue. Hey, it's a Lapras, but we can't engage it. Hello. I want to catch... Tyrogue. Maybe, maybe his spawn rate is pretty low. Oh, we have jelly birds here. Okay, so in this area, it's Haley. Pokemon here are pretty high in terms of level. Hmm. 
Maybe I should use Pikachu instead. It's going to faint Chatul. Should switch now. And the only move that it knows is present. It deals fairly high damage. Well, Pikachu has low defense stat on top of that. Oh nice, it healed him instead. <laughs> or rather her. Our Pikachu is female. Mm. Don't really want to use Electro Ball. I'll stay on using Quick Attack. I'll keep on using Quick Attack. Another, another one. Another one. Quick Attack. This is bad, though. Maybe I should switch to Nick it. Doesn't affect Nick it. Maybe it was supposed to be a healing present. Okay, critical HP. Time to catch him. Don't resist, Delibird. Good. Snarl. What is Snarl again? Three yells as if it's ranting about something which lowers the special attack stats of opposing Pokemon. Also has a power of 55. Hmm. It's special. Special category, which means it's based from special attack. Well, Nikit has a fairly high special attack. Maybe we can remove. Tail whip. You already have one class anyway. Grad grew to level 15. Wonder if he will evolve once he reaches level 16. Okay, so Blip Bug is evolving. Which Pokemon is it going to evolve to? Hmm. The Blip Bug evolved into Dottler. Wonder if this guy has another evolution. Bug Psychic, interesting. It barely moves, but it's still alive. Hiding in its shell without food or water seems to have awakened its psychic powers. Wow. Learn Reflect too. Wow. Learn Reflect and learn Light Screen. It's going to be really helpful in terms of battle. Mm. I need to restore Pikachu's HP. Chatul has been weakened, so I'm s I'm going to swap him. Let's have Pikachu at the front of the party. Are these Spindas? No, no, no. These are not Spindas. <laughs> Panel B. Wait. 
Is this a ground type? Nope, okay. Critical hit. Is your focus? I am not liking that one. Okay, the hail. The hail brought down his HP to critical. That's good. Just hope we can catch him before the hail the hail itself faints him. This is the first time I've heard of a laser focus move. Wonder what does it do? Wild guess. Hmm. Guaranteed critical for the next move he uses. No one leveled up. Next is digging holes. Using its ears, it can dig a nest 33 feet deep in one night. Go into the box. Is that a trainer? So here only Delibirds and Banelby. Maybe there's another one. Who is this? Don't tell me it's another spider. Okay. It's Nover. Grass type. Grass ice. I'll switch Pikachu out. Avoided the attack. This is bad. Come on, thunder wave. Wait, I think this guy has an ability called. Mm, I forgot. <laughs> the ability were. Wait, is there an ability that increases your Pokemon's evasion while inhale? But actually, this is a wrong move. Is grass ice, but you can use ice shard to perhaps one hit my rookie. <laughs> okay, didn't use ice shard. Just one more pack. Okay, didn't use ice shard again. Should switch. One ice shard will kill, will faint Rookity. Let's just sneak it. Two priority moves. Whichever Pokemon has the air speed stat goes first. Crap, rip. Maybe I should use Dotler instead. Let's cast Reflect first, then Confusion. Leaf Edge. It should have all incoming physical attacks.
This can be actually come in handy. I mean, both reflect and light screen gives benefit to, to your party for four turns, five turns. Can't switch to Pikachu. It's just going to faint. Let's try throwing a Pokeball. Okay, so I'm gonna use a potion first to Pikachu, then switch back, and then switch to him. Still have Reflect on. Pikachu should be able to withstand one physical move. We can hit Thunder Wave now. Okay, no more Reflect. And he used Ice Shard. Come on, please hit Thunder Wave. Maybe I was just unlucky earlier. And time to switch back to our reliable bug psychic type, Dotler. Nice, it's paralyzed. Paralyzed and can't move. Should be now easier to catch him. Guess not! Did they, did they make Pokemon more difficult to catch in general, despite it having a critical HP and paralysis. I don't have anyone to inflict sleep yet. Maybe if we are already high enough level, we can catch a Haunter and Hypnosis, and then use Hypnosis. Nice. Go into the box, Snover. I need to restore my party's HP first. And Nikit has fainted. Uh, I need Pikachu badly. And Dotler. Dotler. As for Nikit, maybe I should. Swap him. Let's swap him first. Do we have someone bulky here? Hmm. Maybe let's put Delibird. Wait, never mind. Only knows present. How about this guy? Leafage. Sir Pell. Mm. Fine, I'm gonna use my one revive. One revive for Nikit. Once I run out of potion, then I guess I'm gonna try Pokemon Camp. I'm gonna try camping. I'll just know over. Gotta run, Pikachu. Wonder if there are any other see any other here. Fancy apple. One of the main ingredients that can be used for cooking at your camp, an apple chosen above others. A spectacular form in a brilliant sheen. How about this? Wishing Peace. Throw one into a Pokemon then to attract a wild Dynamax Pokemon. Oh, okay. 
We will need this later on. It's a hoot hoot. Already, already have a hoot hoot, right? Maybe one more. Never mind. Is this a trainer? Hold on. Let me switch my team. Let me switch who's in front. Let's play Chutul. Remember, this is a trainer. Oh, it's not a trainer. Hey there, I found a bit of a rare item here in the wild area. You wanted it? Only 100 watts? What's this? Oh, three experience candies excess. Candy that's packed with energy. When consumed, it will grant a single Pokemon a very small amount of experience points. Hmm. Oh, we're catching that. Wait. Is this the evolved form? I don't remember. Uh Well we have a Poké doll if ever its level is too high. A very strong looking vanillish. Take this one as a high level. Oh crap, 36. We're not going to go up against that guy. <laughs> I think I just saw something. Oh, okay. It's the berry tree loading. Nuzlif. How about C dot? Level 13. Thunder wave right off from the start. We're gonna switch to it's a grass type. So let's swap to Rookity. Use growth. Rookity is in a bad position if it uses a different attack either than grass type. Okay, one quick attack after this one. Wait, we don't have quick attack. Uh, actually, let's try catching it now. It's gonna break out. <laughs> but I was so close. So close. Astonish. Alright. Rookie is not normal flying type. That's why he got damaged by Astonish. Come on. Come on, Azlif. Okay. Great. Pikachu grew to level 16, Rookie is level 15 as well. Paint? This attack hits target using a move such as Protect or Detect. It also lifts the effects of those moves. Gonna pass. And we have a new Pokemon to add to our Pokedex Nuzleaf. It lives deep in forests with the leaf on its head. It makes a flute whose song makes listeners uneasy. Let's heal Rookie D. Actually, let's heal Pikachu and Rookie D. We may need to go camping soon. Delibirds, Delibirds. Who is this guy? 
Okay, it's Vanilla Light. The pre evolved form of Vanilla Lux. Wait, I missed. Missed again. What's the accuracy of Thunder Wave? 95? Move info. 90. That's why. Remember back then when Thunder Wave, Thunder Wave used to have 100, 100 accuracy. Level 11. Let's use Chutel. Nice. Let's use Water Gun. Okay, one more Water Gun. But actually, it was a critical hit. So it only does like one, less than one for damage. Let's try a bite. Avoided the attack. One more. Whoop. Okay. This should do it. Pokeball, Pokeball, Pokeball. Gotcha. Vanilla Light was caught. Pure Ice type. This one is pure Ice type. No, don't chase me. Hello. And my what's? Hmm. I only have 66 watts at the moment. Wishing Peace Waterfall. How do you farm watts anyway? Let me check this tree first. The other bird is not moving there. Check it more. Check it more. One more. One more. No! My berries! That's going to be a different type of Pokemon. Never mind. Well, we got at least a few berries. This one. Let's check this one as well. Let's shake it four times. Okay, that should do it. Eight berries. Good to it. Any other Pokemon here? Maybe we should explore another area. That's going to be an... Oh, hello! No! I'm not going to engage you, big man. What is his name again? 
Something is coming near me. Wait, not Daddy Bird. I don't want Daddy Bird. The amount of Daddy Birds in this area is insane. Including Banelby. Oh, hello! No! <laughs> hey there, big man. I don't intend to fight you, don't worry. Just gonna shake more berries for our Pokemon camp. One more. Alright. Let's check if they're... Hello, mister. What do you have? Found a bit of a rare item here in the wild. There are only 100 watts. Uh, only have 66. Oddish. Already have Oddish. Found a white herb. For now, we don't need it. It's real sunny here. And we're gonna find a bunch of new Pokemon. Dus Duskull. Wait, found a very strong looking Duskull? Why very strong looking? What? Why level 26? <laughs> I expect Duskulls to be around... Wait, back then it will be... Yeah, they're already at high level. <laughs> Maybe just around level 20. How about this guy? Very strong looking deer flume. Don't tell me the Pokemon here are at higher levels. Maybe we can try using a Thunder Wave on this guy. Oh crap, it used Shadow Ball. I think this is going to faint Pikachu. Definitely. Pikachu, no! Because the Pokemons here at are at a much higher level. How about this guy? What is this? The pillars of red light to see in the water are marked Pokemon Dance. The next Pokemon dwell in this dance and you'll be able to battle them by investigating the dance. You can start a battle on your own or get up to three other players to help you out. Max raid battles! To get a Dynamax Pokemon and you'll get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling Dynamax Pokemon. In wild Pokemon Dynamax, they become incredibly powerful. They may unleash multiple moves in a row and take other actions you won't see in a regular battle. Working together with other trainers will be key as you take on this Dynamax Pokemon together as a team of four. Battle ends when Pokemon faint four times or the battle lasts for ten turns. Psychic Fairy? Who's this guy? So we can get what by examining those I guess. Well, that's very strong. Drift Bloom. <laughs> Hold on, I wanna check this guy's level. Not you, Dust. You, Dust Call. Tell me this is also very, so another very strong looking. Another very strong looking Pokemon. Level 28. I'm running out of Pokedolls. Because I can't catch anything here yet. What is this? Let's examine this one. It's not emitting any light. Okay, so I can get what by examining those.
If there's a note here, something. It's an item instead. Got okay, we're in a revive. Hold on, big guy. What's that? Is that a Charmander? Oh no no, it's Krabby. <laughs> Charmander. <laughs> okay, it's called a wild Krabby. It's not doesn't say anything about being a strong looking Krabby. We can catch this one. I'm gonna use scratch so we don't faint it. Pikachu fainted, so we can't use Thunder Wave. But we just got a revive. Hmm. Nah. I think we can. I think we don't need Thunder Wave for this. Th I don't think we need Thunder Wave for this guy. Grad is now level 16. Is he going to evolve? She rather. She's evolving! Grad! Hmm. Interesting. You got evolved into. Twaki? Twaki? Is it red as Twaki? Twaki? The faster a Twaki can beat out the rhythm with its two sticks, the more respect it wins from its peers. Hmm. And he wants to learn double hit. Let's forget Scratch. <clears throat> and we have another Pokemon added to our Pokedex. Two for catching Krabby. Let me switch you, big guy. Switch you to Dotler. Dotter is starting to interest me. I like his moveset. Support boy? Is he going to be our support boy? Confusion. So bulky. <laughs> Maybe he will be my temporary wall. Whoops, whoops. Don't faint, don't faint him. Gotcha. Simple. Dotler has high defense and special defense. Fairly high HP too. Maybe I'll keep him in my party. <laughs> what is this guy? What is this guy's nature? Hope it boosts defense. I'm now interested in him. Okay, neutral nature. Not too bad. Another crabby. This is this who it seems to be? It is. <laughs> Whooper. Catch 
catch galore. I think I should have used Dottler right right off the bat when I began catching. When I began catching. I think he's perfect when it comes to catching. Let's just use Struggle Bug. Whoa! What? How did it faint him? I thought Struggle Bug only has a power of 20. Wait, there's another Whooper. Level 8. Maybe one confusion. Okay, confused itself. Hope it hurts itself. Nope. Can't use another move or Whooper would faint. Uh, so let's try catching it. Well, it's below level 10, so it should be easier to catch, I think. Nice. Cooper evolves into Quagsire, by the way. Forgot what level. Let's examine this for more what? This guy looks familiar. Forgot the name. <laughs> Let's try engaging this Winkle. Not sure if I'll be able to escape because the daughter is slow, so I'm just gonna fight it off. Nice. Inflict confusion. Inflict confused. This be enough to faint him. Nope. Last one. Hurt itself, please. Nice. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Who is that? One oh, Whooper. Have a butter free. Not your electric quit. I'm gonna wait, let's catch this one. <laughs> there was a guy back there which which was offering something or forgot how many watts, one hundred or three hundred. Level 15. What does place nice do? Attack fail. Okay, keep using play nice. Attack decreased by two levels, so one struggle bug. It's not going to kill it. Wait, what? Rapid spin now increases your speed? Okay, 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 okay. Still alive. <laughs> but that's a really neat buff to rapid spin. I mean, imagine Blastoise having rapid spin. You can remove stealth procs, toxic spikes, and on top of that, increasing his speed. I like that buff. Please! Get in the Pokeball!
Okay, Chutil is now level 14 and learned Protect. And of course, we're going to the... Well, actually, I guess I'll just return to the guy later. I'm sure I'm going to go back to the wild area. Wait. Is that an Oddish too? Wait, not you, Electric. Not you. This guy. Stuffle, this is the pre-evo of that bear we saw earlier. The big boy we saw earlier. Let's use Reflect first. It's going to decrease our attack, I think. Dottler is running low on HP. So, let's cast Reflect first. I'm sure this guy has physical moves. We go swing. Oh crap! Super effective. Dark type, I guess. I mean, dark type move. Wait. Confusion is super effective. I forgot this. Forgot this guy's. This guy's type. <laughs> Should be good. Please, one Pokeball. Nice. God is still level 16. Okay. Once he reaches level 17, maybe I'll swap him out. I still plan to catch more Pokemon. No Electric. No! Not you! Let's camp now. Wait. Okay, gain 50 watts. On a note, the wild area is overflowing with a special sort of energy measured in watts. You can gather watts yourself from glowing Pokemon, Pokemon dens and glowing Pokemon in the wild. Okay. I thought it has something to do with your IVs. Hmm. You can also find trainers in the wild area. We're willing to give you all sorts of items if you'll just give them some of your watts. Okay, thank you. There's a different Pokemon here. Nope. It's another Electric. It's another Stuffle. How about this one? There's an item. Energy Root. I'm interested in seeing what Pokemon is that. We have potion. We no longer have potions. Never mind, let's camp. Okay, so what do we do here? Take out toy, zoom, using R button. Take out toy. Wait, where's the tent? You have a tent here? Where? Maybe behind me. Uh. Hey! Rod? Hello, Rod. Wanna play? <laughs> no! Don't attack me! How about... Hey! Let's fetch instead. Fetch this one. Ball, but how do you throw it further? Go get it, Grud. Uh, hey, 
เฮ้ยเฮ้ยยังมันเฮ้ยกูจะทักมีสวอลนู้ how about นิกิตนิกิตเฮ้ยนิกิตเราจะรับบอลเราจะบีบนิกิตเกรดโอ้ยเกรดนี่วันเกรดอินสเตนดีกว่าที่ผมเฮ้ยดีกว่าที่ผมโอเคไปเอาเจ้ Should be faster than him. Good. How about these guys? Hey, take it, bird. <laughs> oh, never mind. Uh, let's cook. Cook up a fine curry without camping by selecting ingredients and berries of your liking. The curries will get more delicious if you choose to do things like using rare ingredients or adding lots of berries too. Once you start cooking, fan the flame, fan the flames with your fan to keep things hot enough. Okay. And stir things up with your ladle to keep it moving. Only don't go overboard. You don't want to spill. The last step will be to add a bit of salt into it. At just the right timing, and you'll have made a masterpiece of your Pokemon to enjoy. After you finish cooking, it'll be time for everyone to dig in together. Eating a tasty curry can have a number of effects on the Pokemon that are at your hand, including storing their HP and making them feel more friendly towards you. Okay. Check ingredients first: fancy apple and taro berries. Start cooking. We'll use our berries. Okay, this is only the key ingredient that we have. Okay. And select a berry. Hmm. Simple berry that's easy to use even for novice cooks. Hmm. Light bitterness, crispy ingredients. Actually, maybe let's add pecha berry. I don't know how many. Can't be too sweet, right? Let's add two orange berries. It's spicy. Our taste is addictive. Maybe one cherry berry. Add a bit of spice, then add a bit of sweetness. We one more orange berry. Uh, what else? It should be book. Should be good. Or let's have ten. One more cherry berry. <laughs> Slight bitterness. One rust. This one is bitter. Pomeg berry. Maybe one lepa berry, and then finally one chester berry. What? It's going to be. <laughs> How do we cook? Fan the flames. Wonder if we are going too fast. How fast should we steer? 
<laughs> Put your heart into it. What do you mean? Just like that. And we have a curry. <laughs> curry made of berries and a fancy apple. Spicy apple curry? How about Pikachu? Where's Pikachu? We're supposed to eat with him. Or with her. We're supposed to eat with her. <laughs> Your Pokemon's HP was restored and its status conditions were healed. Your Pokemon gained experience points. That renders of your party got friendly towards us. Taste rating. Real story class. <laughs> How about Pikachu? Hey Pikachu. Yeah, I'm calling you. Finally, you're up. Thanks to the curry. Attack me! Attack me! <laughs> speak? What do you mean, speak? He just seems to be worried about his surroundings. Let's hmm. chat. He just looks like it wants to play more. Tell me more. Seems a bit bored. Okay, let's play for a bit. You said you wanted to play. Then you're going away. What? Get this guy! Get this! Get this! <laughs> come on, Pikachu! Come on, come on, come on! Change toys. Get this, get this, get this! Fetch! Good! Fetch it again! Good, okay, that's it. I'm gonna stop playing now. And... No, no, not that one. <laughs> Pikachu! Pokemon enjoyed camping and gained some experience points. That's neat. Should we try? Hmm. Alright guys, this will be the end of Episode 4 of Kindred's Let's Play series of Pokemon Sword. Hope you enjoyed watching me cut Watching me catch a bunch of new Pokemon and I'll see you on the next one.